Shipping's responsible for 90% of the world's trade. So any improvement is a global opportunity. While burdened with high cost and rising due to regulation, it's also a heavy polluter. Indeed, it's among the highest emitters in the world. Ranked here sixth on the list of nations between Germany and Japan. Shipping today creates a billion tons of CO2. Think about that. That's equivalent to the amount of carbon produced annually by all the cars in the United States. So there's an economic and environmental problem to solve. Basically, over the past seven years, what we've done is we've created a solution. It's a high-tech sale for all intents and purposes. The fuel savings of over 50% for an industry breaking its back on 2 to 4% savings. Two, it's creating a real means to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. And three, it's a proven technology, one where we can adapt it in a better way in order to meet shipping needs today. So we were inspired by past ingenuity, and we reimagined a technology built way back in the 20s by Anton Flettner. He was a German aviator, and he ripped off the masts of a schooner and replaced them with spinning cylinders. And he propelled that ship with the Magnus effect. Now, the Magnus effect is pretty common. It's the reason a ball curves in midair. Similarly, if you take a wind flow and pass it over a spinning cylinder, it creates a low and a high pressure differential, thereby creating a force perpendicular to the stream of wind. Now, what we did is we took that fixed Flettner rotor and we made it transformable. And the reason that is important, I'll give you a picture here. If you look at a ship in port, there's hovered over the deck of that ship cranes for loading and unloading. Now, the key insight that we received from investors and from ship owners is you can't have anything impede the loading of cargo. So a vertically fixed Flettner rotor would be an unwanted obstruction. So introducing the Magnus Voss, or the vertically variable ocean sail system. So the key innovation here is we retract it below deck and free up port operations. So picture here a 100-foot by 20-foot spinning cylinder. We put four across the biggest ships of the world, and it fully propels the ship. And again, what's special here and what's unique in our competitive advantage is we retract it below deck, both at port and at sea. So with both hardware and software, that combination allows us to have an automated system. Right now, we can calculate savings on any ship anywhere on the planet. And soon to come, we'll have smart routing. So the Magnus Voss is a patented internationally device, which is also approved for deployment. And we're looking at a pretty large market among the 50,000 ships, we're, though highly focused right now on dry bulk carriers, which are delivering grain to feed the world. So we've got a best-in-class technology. We've got meaningful savings and a payback that's pretty quick, and all to meet high-quality interest. So we are ready, finally, to expand the build-out. This is our site in the Philippines where in four years we're on track to create 300 jobs. Yeah. We feel strongly that Magnus will be on the path to create a 100% renewable energy ocean transport and create an economically efficient industry as well as an environmentally friendly one. So if you're interested in learning how to participate or learn more about Magnus and how we truly believe we will transform industry, my name is James Rhodes, and I'd love to see you afterwards. Thank you.